How are you guys doing? I'm actually going for a walk right now in my new neighborhood. In case you guys didn't know, I moved. Woo woo! I'm so excited from my new place. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. I'm just uh, walking around, seeing what's around me. That's what you should do. Anytime you're in a new place, you should explore. You're probably wondering why I decided to leave that nice view I had from where I lived. Well, without getting into too much details, if something's not working out, you need to get out. And that's pretty much what happened to me. <laughs> um, I, you know what? All I can pretty much say is that I'm not going to say it was all bad. It went, it started out good and then it went to like, okay. And then it went to bad and then it was just like terrible. And I just had to move out. And it's one of those things where, you know, obviously there's some situations where you can be like, okay, if something's annoying, maybe you can just suck it up. You know, one of those ends justifies the means type of things. This was beyond that. This was just like, no. It's to the point where it's causing me to lose focus on my goals. You know, it's not conducive to me being successful here. I spent all this money moving to LA. So I'm not gonna let it go to waste by not staying focused on the reason I came here. Same goes to you guys. I hope that if you're ever, you know, feeling unhappy with your situation or you're feeling like something is not conducive to your success, bringing down your motivation, I hope that you take that decision to say, you know what, I need to make a change because you need to do what's best for you. So I'm really happy with my new area. I'm in Santa Monica, Brentwood area. If you don't know what that means, that means that I'm closer to the beach now. Even though I don't go to the beach much, it's still nice. If I have friends come visit, we can go there. And also it's good for just exercise and stuff, going for a jog, going for a run. So anyway, I just wanted to bring you up to speed on what I'm doing. Like I said, don't be afraid to make drastic decisions if things are not working for you or things are not, you know, the environment you need to be successful. Because when I said, remember when I said in my Why I Moved to LA video, I said, you need to be in an environment that is, you know, where there's success around you, there's things happening to help you stay motivated and help you stay focused on your goals. The same thing applies to the actual house you live in, not just the city you live in, but the actual place you live in. It has to be a place where you can focus and you feel happy and you feel motivated. So where I'm at now is I have two roommates who seem really awesome and I made it actually I made a really important decision because of obviously be nice to have my own place but I've made a really crucial decision that I feel is going to pay off later. I've decided to sacrifice having my own place so that I can take that money and invest it and put it into the projects and stuff that I want to work on. So, I don't know, I feel like it's one of those things I'll look back on and be like, okay, that was a really smart decision, not wasting money on really high rent prices and putting that money into things that can really help my future. So, anyway, I guess that's all I want to say. So yeah, I moved, yay, woo woo. While I'm on my walk, I just wanted to show you one of the things I love about LA is the fact that you can go from a house looking like this, to a house looking like this, to a house looking like that to a house looking like this. It's like literally all the houses have so much character and you can put your own touch onto it. So I just want to show you something while I'm on this walk. There's another house there. There's a very slanty looking house. But see, that's what I love about it. It's like all the houses look so different. So there's my new room. Yeah, I know it looks really blank right now, but I'm sure once I put my stuff in it and I decorate it, it's gonna look really cute. I mean. They don't call me SC Magic for nothing. And then this is the closet. It looks small from the outside, but it actually goes like really deep inside. Like there's a lower level and a higher level. So I'm really excited. Hey guys, I'm going to work today. It's a Saturday. You're probably wondering why is she going to work on a Saturday? Well, because that's what you do when you hustle. You work whichever day is required. So anyway, that's what I'm doing today. I still haven't finished unpacking yet, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I'm going to work, and then I'm gonna go get my eyebrows done, then I'll probably do some more work, and that's what I'm gonna do. So anyway, um, I hope you guys continue staying focused on your goals and your dreams, and that you keep being magic. Bye.